Now, yes. Obama's now in trouble uh, with this Christian group, okay, <laughs> for, I guess, apparently on his Father's Day speech, um, it's the American Family Association. He slammed their, he, they slammed his speech uh, as he saluted families with two fathers, uh, and they claimed he was using the holiday to, quote, promote radical homosexuality agenda um, <laughs> to completely sorry, the entire family. I'm um, sorry, we don't have an agenda. We can't agree on anything. <laughs> My, the homosexual no community, agenda there. No, no, you can, it's just as many different people as you can imagine, because it cuts across everything, so we really have no agenda other so than many... just... Different families now. He should be saluting sperm banks as well these days. <laughs> I mean, it's yes. like there are so yes. many different variations of families. And wasn't the first family? You're the, uh, the expert on this. I mean, I'm a Christian well, Adam also. And Eve? No, not Adam <laughs> oh, and Eve. Uh, you said the first family. The only family. <laughs> the whole family. 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 Mary, Mary, an unwed mother. Mary, Ma Mary, Mary. Mary. Well, yes, that Virgin was, Mary. She wasn't married yet. Okay. Well, she they, wasn't they were married. Engaged. Were they engaged? They were, I thought they were, they were engaged. They were engaged. Was, basically, was, basically, was, was Mary married? Married was married. No, she wasn't married. No, she wed mother. They were homeless, living in a barn. Well, they right. there was no room at the hotel, exactly. so they had to stay in the, in the mortgage the on it, <laughs> and they're out of it now. And he married her anyway. Yeah, I mean, John I think married a great her anyway. Lesson to be learned here. Joseph. My Joseph. Concern, Joseph. You know, a concern that I think I have, and maybe some other people do too, is Obama said it in the speech, but I'm not sure that his words are met with action. You know what I mean? He said he was going to come in and redefine "don't ask, don't tell," yeah. redefine uh, marriage, gay marriage, but I'm not sure what's actually been done. So are his uh, words actually louder than his actions? Answer maybe yes. What have you done with Elizabeth Hassel? <laughs> I mean, no, I think. She no, I know she is. I no, think and that's I so true. It's so okay, but you, okay, you, you tell me, okay, you you're, tell you're, me you're, or not. But I know <laughs> this yeah. has been, this has been on the books for a long time. The don't ask, don't tell repeal, right, yeah. and it's been, and he's doing that now. Other people are saying we've got to look at. He's didn't not doing it, it, isn't done what, anything yet. Did it get, did it get repealed? What's been happening no, with the don't ask? It's, 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 they're not asking and they're not telling about the whole don't ask, don't tell. <laughs> it, it, it lays there. It's the military. It's a lot of the, the higher, older guys in the military. Oh, no, the, the, you can talk to because the military officials. Because I know that Obama can change just... it with the stroke of a pen and yeah. he doesn't do it. And we don't like it. And they keep promising. Okay. These Democratic presidential candidates keep yeah. promising us. They come to us, we will repeal. And then they don't. And we... Get thrown and you're not happy about it. Just in perspective, for sure. Get happy. Hey, He's before... not the Messiah. Nope. <laughs> I don't think he is.